fucking way. No way. Excuse me. Yeah. Do you guys have shrimp fried rice? I have fried rice that has shrimp in it. Like, the shrimp isn't in the rice, like the shrimp makes the rice. <laughs> I'm serious. Some people may say the Mona Lisa, Starry Night, or the David are the truest forms of art, but those people are wrong and pretentious. You see, through the internet past the loads and loads of porn, I'm talking a lot, like a lot of porn, is where you will find true art. I'm talking, of course, about memes. And one such meme has taken both the aquarium and culinary world by storm. <laughs> You're telling me a shrimp fried this <laughs> rice? But the shrimp is not in the rice. The shrimp fries the rice. You're telling me a shrimp fried this rice? No fucking way. Oh, oh my God. They say life imitates art, and as a, a chef and an artiste myself, I feel no, I am obligated to make this art come to life. Shrimp are unfortunately too small and too stupid to cook on their own. So I need to rig a small camera to a shrimp tank that captures the video and uses Python code to translate the shrimp's position into commands to cook the rice. When the shrimp moves to any of the four corners on screen, it'll relay the information to an Arduino that then activates one of the four servos to add different ingredients. If the shrimp passes the middle portion of the screen, a separate DC motor will stir the rice using a big ass wooden spoon, similar to the one my mom used to beat me with. But Dan, I hear you ask, doesn't this work the same way as the fuck you Michael Reeves turtle controlled straw shooting robot? Uh, first of all, smart ass, no. It's more complex in a variety of different ways that you wouldn't even begin to understand. Oh boy, oh, oh, looky, oh, sh here it is, all done. This is falling apart faster than my last marriage. Battery pack, on. Power supply, on. Okay, it's still not turning on. What the fuck? Oh, that's my problem. There are seeds in my power supply. Live problem solving, look at that. Crazy quirky, now it should turn on. God, fuck! Now work, there it is. Plug in Arduino, go over here, start the code, God damn. The shrimp moves into any of the four corners and then that activates the respective servo. See, like that. The shrimp goes into the middle and then the little DC motor goes off. Now before I finish building the machine, I need to make a suitable home for these shrimps. So first, like, I already did that three months ago and now I have 50 goddamn shrimp in my house. I used a spare tank that I had, planted it, let it grow in for a few weeks because shrimp like a, like a nice milf of an aquarium, you know, one that's got some age to it with algae and literal shit to feed off of. And then I ordered my shrimp off Amazon. That's right, fucking Amazon. They mailed me shrimp. God bless capitalism and the exploitation of developing nations for cheap labor. The shrimp then bred like rabbits on crack, probably because I emptied literal narcotics into the water, and now I have an entire colony of John Favreau. So now I'm essentially like Eddie Murphy in the hit 2003 comedy Daddy Daycare, except uh, I'm white, and instead of children, I have shrimp. Oh, that clip was from two months ago. I want to die. I ran into a little oopsie. -daisy. Remember this little shitty DC motor that I stupidly thought would stir the rice? Turns out it's complete dog shit that has less torque than a screwdriver if it were made of soggy paper towels soaked in baby piss. So I just had to upgrade motors, which is easy peasy, right? Well, the larger motor required me to have more power and give it dedicated power. So I got Wooden something called frame, an electronic to, like, speed control. control. Two hours on the phone Eight with one of my friends trying to figure out how the heck to get it to work because penis, all the instructions were in Chinese. Penis, I had to get rid of the breadboard. Penis, the breadboard penis, wasn't really penis, working in tandem Basically, with it was a lot of dumb, boring, lonely, sad bullshit, but it's done. Here it is. Isn't she beautiful? I built this wooden stand with two by fours, connected them with other two by fours. It's overbuilt, it's over-engineered, it sucks, I don't care. Electronic speed controller to control the little DC motor that's suspended up here with a little bracket. This controls all the servos. The servos are hot glued to these tubes and the arms basically stop ingredients from falling down until they're activated. Then the arm swings out, ingredients fall in. Massive brain genius innovation. I'm a NASA engineer, I'm Mark Rober. Ingredients go up in the funnels. Then this connects to my computer that'll have the external camera hooked up to see where the shrimp moves. And then here, of course, is our big ass wooden spoon connected to the DC motor. That's it. It's not much, but it will work. Oh, also in the time I've been gone, look at this. The shrimp have had like another hundred babies. Look how tiny that one is. She's freaking minuscule. I think it's only fair that our little chef already has a little bit of a natural affinity for rice. So we're just gonna go ahead, set the trap and wait. Look at this one. She can smell the rice. Go in, 
Yes, she's going for it. She's munching on the rice. We're gonna, we're gonna nab her. We're gonna nab this one. Dude, we got her, no way. We got her. We got her. All right, little lady, you're coming with me. You are destined for great things. I sure am hungry. Boy, I could use some shrimp fried rice. <laughs> We got the rice frying station over here. We got the computer over there with the code and we got the shrimp right here. Let's start this up. Oh my God, he's doing it. Look at the little chef. Yo, we have a pea. We have an ingredient. It added a frick. Yo, carrot. Oh my God, he's doing it. Look at my boy. <laughs> Look, there's a little onion back there. Oh my God. Oh, we're losing peas. <laughs> he's actually doing it. Look, it's free. <laughs> Oh my god, look, it's adding more peas. It's adding more peas while he's in the peas thing. Look at him go. Look at the little guy. It's adding egg. He's got to add egg. Add freaking... Add freaking egg. Look, there it goes, there it goes, there it goes. Look at it, look at it, look at it, look at it. These people are just moving in. They have no idea that a shrimp is frying rice over here. Look at the little guy. Look at him, look at him stir. Look at him mix that. I didn't expect this to actually work. I cannot believe it. I, I walked inside to wash my hands. I come back, all these ingredients are stirred around. Mamma mia, look at, look at it. It's a spicy, it's a spicy. He's cooking up a storm. Mamma mia, look at him go. Oh, we got a lost pee. Hey, relax, chef. Calm down, buddy. <laughs> wow, that does a really, really shitty job. It's been like 20 minutes and it actually looks like it has made a semi-decent little fried rice here. We have actual shrimp fried rice. He did it. Look at my little boy. Look at him go. Oh, oh my God. Oh, that's way too fast. Bro, 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 bro. Oh my God. Why is it going so fast? Why is it doing that? What's happening? Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh shit. All right, that's it. Oh, this looks... Mmm, that looks delicious. Oh yeah, beautiful. <sighs> All right, y'all. Time to eat. Oh, actually, when you get past the burnt bits, it's not bad. And the raw bits. I feel like there was maybe an easier way I could have done this meme. Do they make shrimp costumes? All right, I'm a shrimp. Yo, I'm a fucking shrimp. Let me cook. Turn the heat. Cops.